Hi everybody, today we're here at Treasure Island over here in Tampa Bay, Florida. Are you excited, Dawn? Yeah. Now we've stayed here before and we love it here. It's actually our to-go place when we're down here in this area. You ready, Dawn? I'm ready. Let's, Let's do, do this. It. We're here at the Beachside Resort. So we're in room number six. You can tell it's really well uh, kept up. We're all the way down here on the end. There's the there's the pool there. Here we are, room six. Our room is six. Ready? Yeah. Oh, wow. So you got the queen size bed, right? Right. And then you have a nice little... Table and chairs for two. And some nice... End tables. End tables. Lamps. I noticed that they have plugs. There's also an alarm clock. And wow, I like the accents. This is a really cool, um, well put together little beachside room. What do you think about that? It's nice. <laughs> and there's a microwave. And a and stove and refrigerator. I mean, stove. <laughs> or do I mean, refrigerator and freezer. Refrigerator and freezer. Yeah. Yes, sir. Got a nice little TV, uh, remote control. Got the end room coffee. Oh yeah, it's a little freezer and that will do perfect. I like this little, like little chair here. Look at that. And it smells really clean. It smells clean. It smells really clean. And then over here, it's got like a really plush, soft. plush soft little ac accents here of course there's two pillows and this is a queen queen size bed it actually looks clean down in there and then over here what do you got the closet got a closet it's a big closet you guys and you put a lot you in there shelf and your luggage rack and an extra blanket this is a blocking <laughs> closet right and an iron ironing board of course <laughs> wow <laughs> Then you have the, um, it's got a central air and heater. And it's clean. Let's go check the bathroom out. Sure. Oh, wow. You your standard sink and mirror and you got your toilet and tub and shower. Look at the tile on the floor. And uh, I love, definitely love the, the beach um, feel there. And of course the, Look at all the toiletries, they give you quite a bit actually. And the tub looks really good too. It's got a it's, it's got a window. It's got a window. <laughs> the shower head looks pretty cool. Little tub. Um definitely uh mom and pop, but this is a super 
super clean. I'm actually quite impressed um, with this place. What do you think? So this is our go-to place when we're here in Florida. Uh, normally we stay at a place called the Tahitian, but uh, we decided with this one, it was a lot cheaper. We spent $80 uh, a night for this. This is actually on the beach. We'll show you the beach uh, shortly. Um, this is the reason why we like the Treasure Island area so much is because it's all mom and pop hotels. It's got that old uh, Florida feel. Um, nothing crazy here. Uh, of course, Sloppy Joe's is down the street. So um, this is another one of their locations. But this place is just, just beautiful. I love the old time uh, flair. So Dawn, what do you think about this old school mom and pop hotel? I, I like it. It's got a nice feel to it. Yeah. And a lot of these hotels are very well maintained um, by just not corporations, but by, you know, uh, real folks and stuff. So we're gonna go ahead. Uh, we're gonna show you well the rest of the grounds here And then we're gonna show you the beach and uh, it's a beautiful day. It's uh, 75 degrees. So we're excited We're gonna get a little beach time in and the carpet is so so clean in here, too Couldn't find any any imperfections Check out that pool Crystal clear beautiful little pool area just a cute little little hotel here I love the little walk up and then out here they got shuffleboard oh, okay. yeah I got shuffleboard and a little lounging area and the beach is just just out there nice little charcoal grill here we're now out here on the on the beach yes the there is a slight walk to the beaches here on uh, Treasure Island but you got seashells these are all different types of seashells you can find out here of course the Florida crown clonk and then you are here our Treasure Island just mom and pop after mom and pop little hotels and you love treasure island yes i do it's very pretty here also the beaches are white and sandy just like an ashtray <laughs> <laughs> And they have some of the most beautiful, plentiful seashell abundance I've ever seen on any beach, as far as the eye can see. Well, that boat's got a sign that says, free, free tacos. Buy one every Taco Tuesday. Check out that shell. Oh, here comes the water. <laughs> so if there's any place that I would want to move to other than the Smokies, or at least uh, spend some time, would be here in the Treasure Island area. Um, I don't know, it just, uh, I just love, love the feel of it here. Hopefully, 
big corporate America don't move in one day and build these huge high-rise resorts like you'll see on other beaches um, in the area. I just love this 1950s uh, feel of things here. Definitely a little, little piece of paradise. Well, there's the yeller Jeep. Well, good morning, good morning everyone. everyone. We had a beautiful sunset. Of course, we did a live stream last night. We do live streams on Sundays, every Sunday on this channel. And what'd you say about our rest here? It was good, it was nice. Very super clean. I enjoyed it. Uh, I loved it, yeah. The bed was actually comfortable, uh, so it was really good. Uh, so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna head on down to uh, John's Pass, which is a really cool place. A lot of shops, eateries, and sometimes you can catch the dolphins in the bay swimming around. So we're hoping to see that. Um, and then after that, we're gonna be heading, well, our, on our next destination. So you ready, Dawn? Ready. Let's do this. Let's do we're here at John's Pass, Village and Boardwalk. Hey guys, we're here at the pass. and. Uh, it's a nice little place. I love to come down here and just take in the atmosphere. Of course, they have a festival going on right now, selling all kinds of cool beach stuff. We'll take a look at that. They're just setting up, but um, your friends on the ceiling. Yeah, I got a. <laughs> How'd you get up there in the ceiling? I didn't know that gators walked around on the ceiling. <laughs> I didn't either. They but there's there's all kinds of little gift shops and uh, just that board. That boardwalk feel. <laughs> Check this surfboard guy out. Second floor. Oh, there's a, a toucan and a, a alligator attraction. There's an alligator attraction out there? I believe that's a, a marlin. Looks like there's gonna be a little entertainment today. Looks like this tiki guy has got some, some drinks. Well, we're gonna come up to the bay here. Let's see what's going on. Hopefully we can see some dolphins this morning. Uh, oh, there's a dolphin right out there, Don. I just seen him. There he is, you see the dolphin? The two of them, I think. Yeah, oh, there he jumped out of the water. Yes, I did. <laughs> wow. This is where they hang out, for sure. There they are. <laughs> we just got up here and we saw the dolphins. They're they're everywhere. <laughs> this is their little play play place here. Of course, it helps that there's fishermen all along here, and you know, there's a lot of food, but. There he goes, he jumped out of the water again. <laughs> Trying to catch these guys are, are pretty hard. I don't know when he's going to do it again. There they are over there. Oh, 
her out there swimming in the bay. Wow, it was amazing seeing those dolphins. We just walked up. Now they're going out to further out in the bay. So we made it just in time to see them. And I actually got one jumping out of the water, but they were jumping out of the water like crazy. I think I only got it one time on camera, but yes, made my day. Wow. <laughs> Check out this boat here. <laughs> it's a it's a shark. <laughs> Dawn, there's a there's a boat shaped as his jaws. <laughs> he did. I didn't know he was a boat the whole time. He in this <laughs> that is that is cool. Got these little dockside restaurants here. And there's actually fish fishermen that will bring their catch up here and they'll cook them in these restaurants fresh. So that's if you're into uh, fresh seafood. I also got jet ski rentals. Plenty, plenty of jet ski rentals. Wild seafood. They have Red Snapper from 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. They have Scamp Grouper, uh, Red Grouper, and other assisted species. They'll actually ship it to you. Tiki Shack down there. It looks quite interesting. It's got like a fish and just a, just a lot going on there. Now look at their catch. They're icing them up and here's a little ice cream place. Kind of reminds me of the days being a kid and the ice cream truck would pull up. And uh, I used to get the little plastic cups with like the bubble gum in the bottom. I don't know if they got those anymore. Oh, they have they have SpongeBob SquarePants and they got uh, the old push-ups there. But it's a cute and nice little place here to sit, relax, take in some ice cream, or over here they got they got tacos here. Of course we're here early in the morning. And just watch what's going on out here in the bay. And check out these little tiki huts. You can actually rent those and go out on the water and take all your friends. And I guess you can you have your own floating bar. Oh wow, look, there's there's a pelican, Don. Look at the size of them guys. Hello, Mr. Pelican. Did you catch anything good to eat today? They got some saltwater taffy going here. Look at that. Well, this looks like a really cool place to eat here. Um, got a hammerhead shark and looks like there's a there's a pirate over there. Got old Mr. Hammerhead up there and I think they call that one a, a double ray. You guys are just eat, eating away they are. A little a little seafood this morning, huh? A little seafood breakfast. We're here at the world's largest chicken wing. Look at that. It weighs in at 1,037 pounds. That's big. It says the world's largest. Chicken that, wing. that is one big chicken. A family of 10 could share that. Once that chicken was still around, it could be chasing Dawn around. That'd be like, it'd be like 20 foot tall. We found the Salty Sisters, but they're they're closed. Womp, womp, womp. Like me until I scream. <laughs> that is a really cute little little ice cream stand. Look look at that. The sandbar. Isn't it? Oh wow, there's an there's an octopus over there, Dawn. Oh wow. Yeah, yeah. This has definitely got to a feel to it. I, I love that saying. I've never heard that before. It's a that's a new one. <laughs> what do you think about that? It's cute. <laughs> it is. Dawn has her eye on some ice cream here. Look at look at that. They got an orange aid. A vanilla shake. And I got myself some orange aid. You put more cream on it. Yeah. Really good. It's a 
a fresh, sunny drink for sure. They gave you a free St. St. Pete Beach, but they got some really cool goodies in there. Hand sanitizing. Oh, you that's can't. A big bottle. That's a huge bottle. A they're, really cool mask. They're just giving, giving these bags away. That's pretty, pretty I cool. Mm, St. Pete Beach. In a magazine. Of course, about the beaches. All right. Looks like this pirate is up to <laughs> no good. He's sitting on a on a treasure chest. At least he's, I guess he's being safe wearing that mask. Definitely a beachy type um, gift store. I got this Florida ashtray. <laughs> uh, so there's a lot of cool, cool places. We've, we've driven all the way around the outside of Florida now. It's a, followed the coastline. Of course, shot glasses are always a must. And then you had, oh, some beachy, well, decor for the home. And pretty soon, hopefully, we'll be seeing you, Mickey. <laughs> but just your, your basic gift shopping. Just the theme changes depending on where you're at. Those are really cool little, little manatees. Sea turtles. Here's a can of Florida sunshine we can send up to some of our friends up there in the Great White North. It's actually empty. You can put a post stamp on there. And if you're at the beach, you got to have a seashell shot. Sea shell shot. <laughs> Just a pile of gator heads. I've heard of rabbit's feet, but how about gator feet? Or is it real? Yeah, they're real gator's oh, I feet. Touched it. You touched it. I didn't know it was real. <laughs> I touched. It. That's John's pass. What did you think, Dawn? It was nice. We got to see some dolphins and some pelicans and Jump, some other birds jumping out of the water. What's better than that? They were great out there this morning. They're doing uh, their tricks. <laughs> they were, they were. Uh, Treasure Island was great as always. We got to spend a little time on the beach, watch the sunset. Guys, it was just beautiful yet again. But that's going to do it for, well, today's vlog. And if you like this vlog, give it a, give a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Also, please subscribe so you miss these upcoming road trip adventures, guys. We're heading to Orlando next. And then, until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Think you'll see the Mickey Mouse? We'd like to. You never know. You never know.